Good morning, everyone. My name is Isaac. And my name is Mara. It is April 18th and a day two. Seventh graders, remember, today is the deadline to turn in your web applications to Mrs. Peterson or Mr. Canton. You must turn them in by 3.05 today. No excuses. Students, are you interested in learning more about fishing? I know you've heard the announcement all last week, but this is an amazing opportunity. School of Fish with Mike Frisch, pro angler and TV host, is back to teach you the ins and outs of fishing. Yeah, the class is April 26th from 6 to 8.30 at Middle School West. Register today and receive your own equipment pack, including a fishing rod and reel. Register online or call Community Ed, or pick up a flyer in the office for more information. And now for some sports announcements. 7th and 8th grade softball teams are east tonight against Cambridge at 4.30. A games are first. The golf team is at Vintage tonight against Cambridge at Sandy at 4.30. The track team is home tonight against Big Lake and Chisago Lake at 4.30. 7th and 8th grade baseball teams are home tonight against Cambridge at 4.30. A games are first. And boys tennis team is at Becker High School tonight. Bus leaves from the front door at 3.20. Make sure to wish all these teams good luck at their games. Now it is time for the book buzz. And remember, the snack wagon will be available in the atrium for all you sports players that need to fuel up before a game or match. Welcome to the book buzz. I'm Olivia, and I'm here with Bella, who is reading the book, The Barcode Tattoo. What type of book is it? The Barcode Tattoo is a scientific fiction book. What is the book about? The book is about this girl named Kayla, and it's what everybody wants to do on their 17th birthday is get the barcode tattoo on their wrist, but it holds all of your personal information. And then she becomes suspectant of the barcode tattoo when people around her start losing their jobs after all their bosses see what personal information they have, what they're hiding. Thanks, Bella. Now we have Graceland who is reading the book Everneath. What is your book about? My book is based off of Greek, Greek mythology. It's based off of the myth of Personophene, um, but with a twist. The main character, Nikki Beckett, has, she went to the underworld for 100 years. Now she's returned to the surface. She has six months to either say her goodbyes or figure out how to stay on Earth. What made you choose this book? The lady at the bookstore recommended it to me. There you have it, Middle School West. Two good books for you to consider to read. Back to you in the studio. Man, those books sound awesome. I can't wait to get my hands on them. Hey, I'm hungry. What's for lunch today? Well, in the main line, there's crispy chicken tenders or spicy chicken tenders. And in the sandwich line, there's hamburgers or cheeseburgers. Sounds good. Now let's draw our two I Got Caught Reading winners. The first winner is Tate Lidberg. And the second winner is Carter Hoyt. Make sure to stop by in the media center to claim your prize. Please say the Pledge of Allegiance at this time. And have a totally rad day. <laughs>